Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In Publisher, you can use the Page Setup dialog box to set the dimensions of the paper, its layout, margins, and printable areas in the publication. To do this, simply click the Page Design tab in the ribbon. The buttons that control the page layout of the publication are in the Page Setup group on this tab, right over here. You can click the Margins drop-down at the top here to select the margins for your current publication. You can choose from any one of these. If you would like to set custom margins, select Custom Margins at the bottom, and that will open the Layout Guides dialog box that we see here. In the Master Pages section, you can check the two-page master checkbox located right there if you'll be setting margins for a two-page master. In the Margin Guides area just below that, you can then enter custom margins into the left, right, top, and bottom spinner boxes. So you would just go here and you can either enter a value or you can use the little arrows to change those dimensions like that. When you're finished, you just click the OK button to apply the margins to your document. Now the margins appear within your publication area as the blue lines that surround the page. Now when designing your publication, you want to make sure that you don't place any content that you wish to print into these designated margin areas or you won't see them. We'll go ahead and click Cancel. You can also switch the page layout from portrait to landscape and vice versa by simply clicking the orientation drop down button in the page setup group on that same page design tab in the ribbon and then just selecting your choice. That easy. You can also select a new paper size from the size drop down button just below that giving that a click, and choosing from the available choices here. All sorts of different choices. You can also create a custom page size, orientation, and margins all at once by using the Page Setup dialog box. To do this, either click the Page Setup dialog box launcher in the lower right corner of the Page Setup group on the Page Design tab in the ribbon, located right there, or click the Size button in the same group, and then choose the Page Setup command near the bottom. Same thing. Now in the Page Setup dialog box, you enter the height and width of the paper in the Width and Height spinner boxes in the Page section right here. In the Margin Guides section below that, you enter the desired margins into the top, left, bottom, and right spinner boxes. And then in the Layout Type section, you use the drop-down to choose a layout type, whatever your choice is. For the selected layout type, you will then enter any additional settings into the Options section. So depending on what you pick, if you select Booklet, for example, you might get some different options folded card, here we have a sheet fold, what kind of sheet fold do you want, and so forth. So different options will be selected for you. We'll go ahead and click Cancel. So that's how you use Page Setup and adjust your margins, your orientation, the page size, and so forth. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.